Hoya YouTube and uh, yes they call it Mellow Yellow it was a song about that wasn't there but uh, picked this up a couple of weeks ago from uh, Nick over there Black Spirit over in Wales and uh, I always fancied one of these and um, he said to me when he was, he sent me a message one day and he was asking me would I be interested in it because I was after his uh, Stag 357 with the Maurer module in it but uh, he wouldn't sell that and uh, he sent me a message asking me did I want to buy this so we did a deal and he said to me uh, before he sent me any pictures he said no he said somebody has painted the cases bright yellow and he wasn't telling any lies it doesn't come much more yellow than that but do you know something the more I look at it the more it's growing on me so um, it's staying yellow I'm not going to bother but when it's in there anyway you can't really see it so it doesn't make any difference so um, all I've done to it is I've put an LED in it and uh, I straightened up the I straightened up the reed out it was kind of slanted down uh, so much that the uh, the decimal point LED was kind of halfway as below this part of the the bezel here, so we uh, we straightened that up and we cleaned all the knobs and uh, just painted in the little lines on them. But uh, works lovely. Not a whole lot happening here today. These aren't going on in ten. Uh, nothing. Uh, go back. Yeah, so these, uh, it's not actually a counter. This is just a, a readout. The same as a channel display. It works the same way. Gets its information from the encoder. Uh, so it's not an actual readout. But it looks cool. And um, it's bog standard with the exception the CVPA switch that is a 5kc jump to get the zeros so 555 there when you click up here it's 560 so it's kind of handy clarifier is locked um, as I said bog standard and uh, just had a QSO to a friend of mine Nicky over in Mullingar probably about 40 minutes away from here and uh, he said it sounded spot on so we're running it there with the old a static on it. Uh, different to some of them. Uh, Nick has put in a two colour LED here. They normally just have a red LED. Like on the stag I have there. But um, yeah. As I said I always fancied one of these. So uh, I have one now. And we'll slot it in there. And uh, it'll be part of the personal collection. So there you go. That is the WKS 1001 uh, three band from uh, 11 meters and it covers most of the, the the bit of 10 meters that you want for voice and uh, AM upper and lower based very closely on, on the atoms these inside and uh, I'm quite happy with it. It works really well. So uh, thanks a lot Nick and uh, we'll get you all again in the next one. 73 and thanks for watching. Bye bye.